We'll hand off control to the ALS. This is the autonomous launch sequencer on board the rocket. You will take over command and control of the rocket. But the ALS will check, make sure there's no holes coming to the ground up until T minus the ALS. Go for ALS. And we are go for ALS. The space launch system is now counting down to lift off of Orion on its maiden voyage to the moon. Launching can no longer recycle the count. Sound to pressure water now flowing under the ML. And here we go. Height to burn off igniters initiate. Seven, six, five, four stage engine start. Three, two, one. Boosters in ignition.
for four minutes and 16 seconds into the flight of Artemis 1. So far, we've had a clean ascent. We saw the solid rocket boosters just in about two minutes and 11 seconds after liftoff, shortly after we had the third module pairing, panel bearing separate, as well as the launch abort system. The launch abort system went inert for this flight, except to perform this separation. Those four core stage engines will continue to fire and power the flight of Artemis 1, now traveling over 6,800 miles per hour, 229 miles downrange. Booster flight controller reports that the engines are looking good. Our core stage main engine cutoff time is about 8 minutes and 3 seconds. We are now 5 minutes and 11 seconds into the flight, 7,656 7, miles per hour. Again, four good core stage engines, those four RS-25 engines. The last time those core stage engines flew, they were in space shuttle orbit, now with upgrading capabilities that are launching the future of human space flight. Five minutes, 42 seconds into the mission. We are now traveling 8,800 miles per hour, 345 miles downrange from the launch pad at Kennedy Space Center. Again, we are anticipating core stage main engine cough at about eight minutes and three seconds. And about 10 seconds later, we'll see core stage separation, at which point Orion and the interim cryogenic propulsion stage will be flying free. Now traveling over 10,000 miles per hour, 6 minutes and 15 seconds into the flight of Artemis 1, 427 miles downrange. Quiet here on the loop in Mission Control Houston. Teams continue to monitor this first flight. About a minute and a half now until that first stage manager cut off time. Our full 